What it do? What it do? What it do? Murphy WWE crew. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Murphy family. WWE, WWE yesterday, WWE today, WWE forever. Let's dive right in. Let's dive right in. Let's dive right in. Public service announcement. This video may contain potential spoilers. So if you are one that does not like spoilers if you're one that does not like the backstage reports of wrestling and for things to potentially be spoiled then you may want to click off this video this may not be the video for you i'm giving you fair warning to do so cue the countdown i'm going to give you 10 seconds to click off before we dive in 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 one. All right, let's go, man. Uh, according to backstage reports from the Fightful Select, uh, Sean Ross Sapp of the Fightful Select, he is reporting that indeed it is the one, the only Bray Wyatt who is behind this white rabbit mystery. Yes, yes, yes. I know that we all believe that it is Bray. I know you got a couple of haters out there, naysayers out there, probably some AEW guys out there thinking that they're going to land Bray Wyatt. Not so fast, my friend. Bray Wyatt is coming home where he belongs, baby. He's coming back to the WWE. So yes, once again, according to backstage reports of the Fightful Select, Sean Ross Sapp of the Fightful Selects, also my good friend over in the UK, C Wrestling. He covers wrestling, um, and I get a lot of my information from him. He also made a video about this, so go check his video out as well. But yes, 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 uh, the reports are all leaning towards Bray Wyatt being the guy behind the White Rabbit. Or in other words, Bray Wyatt is the White Rabbit. The White Rabbit is Bray Wyatt, and he may be making his reveal real, real soon. If you don't know, the Fightful Select, that's one of the biggest wrestling uh wrestling reporters out there right wrestling papers or whatever you want to call it um they get paid the big bucks to report this stuff and um yes they are reporting that indeed it is bray white all right so man i'm super pumped super excited i've always believed it to be bray white but we'll talk about that in a second but before we go any further have you checked out our news video we posted it earlier today um, in the midst and in the hype and in the in test in anticipation and excitement of Bray Wyatt returning in this old white rabbit mystery. We put together a nice little first time I've ever done it. We put together a nice little uh, custom music package of Bray Wyatt, the white rabbit. You know, we had some fun with it. Uh, you know, we got some some of that white rabbit music in there. Uh, we got some of that feed your head, right? Um, we got some of that, uh, the old fiend music, let me in, um, pulled some stuff from the Wyatt family. So we kind of threw all his characters together and created a banger of a track, if you will, a banger of some music. So go check it out, man. It'll be, uh, you see it popping up on your screen now, but it'll be down in the comment section of this video. It'll also be down in the description of this video and at the end of this video. So if you haven't checked it out already, go check it out, man. It's pretty fun, pretty cool. Check it out and let me know your thoughts. Just had a little fun, fun with it, all right? Now, back, back to business, back to business, back to, had to get a little quick plug in there. So, Extreme Rules, October 7th. Could that be the potential return of Bray Wyatt? That is October 7th. Uh, as we sit here today, we'll make this video. That is only nine days away. Super pumped. So if Bray is coming back at Extreme Rules, that's only nine days away, man. I'll be there for that. I'll be in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Um, yes, yes, yes. We will be there. We will be there. We will have boots on the ground. So if Bray does return, you best believe um, I'm going to be amongst that WWE universe screaming and losing my mind. And I'm going to film it for you guys so uh, you guys can check it out. All right. Um, so, yes, yes, yes. Heads up on that. Heads up on that. Heads up on that. But um, so let's see. We, we, we know that WWE, they've been doing these white rabbit clues every Monday and every Friday. So if this continues, then we looks like we may have six of these six of these mysteries or six of these clues. We've had three already. There's three more shows before uh, before Extreme Rules gets here um, on the 7th. So we have uh, SmackDown tomorrow night. What the, what's that? September 30th, the September 30th edition of SmackDown Live. And then we have Raw on Monday. And then we have next week's SmackDown, which is the go-home show for Extreme Rules. It's the final show before Extreme Rules. We have that one. So we've had three already, three upcoming. So that'll make it a total of six. 
um, Wyatt Six, you know, keeping with that theme, Wyatt Six, right? The, will we see the sixth iteration of Bray Wyatt? Uh, Bray Wyatt evolved, you know, his sixth character. I don't know, but it looks like we'll get six of these clues. Now, at Extreme Rules, uh, will Bray Wyatt return? Or at Extreme Rules, will the White Rabbit be, you know, the mystery be solved, revealed? Um, I don't know how they're going to do it, man. Um, or will there be a more buildup after this? Will we move from this onto something else? Um, will the clues just get bigger? I don't know. Or will Bray Wyatt show up at Extreme? I don't know. But whatever happens, I'm down for the ride. And I hope you guys are as well. I'm enjoying it. I hope you guys are enjoying it as well. And uh, whatever happens, man, I'm here for it. I mean, I want all the smoke. I'm here for it all. All right. So again, I don't know how they're going to do it. You go back and look at the Fiend character. Um, he didn't just pop out, you know, you had these creepy, scary, spooky promos and vignettes, right? Then you had the whole fire, the Firefly Funhouse stuff. Um, and then um, the Fiend was revealed and then the Fiend showed up and started attacking people. Then the Fiend had a match and the Fiend won the title. So I don't know how they're going to do it. I don't know if they're going to do that. Say, I don't even know if the Fiend will be the character that's returning. I don't know if it'll be the Wyatt family. Uh, the Eater of Worlds, Bray Wyatt. Um, I really don't know. Will it be an entirely new character? I don't know. So we don't know. So there's a lot to come, you know, from this story, man. So it's very exciting. It's very exciting. It's very exciting. Um, we'll see what happens. We will see what happens. We will see what happens. But I'm predicting that he's going to return or make a reveal at Extreme Rules. And maybe you set up a match for him. His first match, return match, will be at, at, uh, um, you got Crown Jewel coming up or Survivor Series. I don't know. Or maybe this thing drags out even longer. You drag it all the way out to, to next year, <laughs> WrestleMania. I don't know, man. But whatever it is, I'm super pumped. I think we're getting closer and closer to a Bray Wyatt return. Um, but you guys, comment down below. Let me know your thoughts. I want to hear what you guys think. I want to know what you guys are feeling. Um, you know, WWE Universe, sound off, man. This is a place for you to be heard, um, to get your voice out there. And um, yeah, so jump in the comment section and let's chop it up. All things Bray Wyatt, all things White Rabbit. If you're excited for his return, if you believe he's returning at Extreme Rules, let me know, all right? Thank you guys for tuning in. We'll catch you in the next one. Be blessed, be safe. Peace.